I feel that a positive male role model is someone that you can look up to, someone who can inspire, someone who can lead others, whether they're men or women. And for me, personally, it's been about being a good father, a good husband, and good teammate with my colleagues at St. Luke's. I support my physical well-being um, by looking after my family, my children roaming ragged, uh, but luckily we live on the edge of Dartmoor, we're very close to the coast, so we like to get out and explore nature, and we do this on a regular basis, and it really makes us a happy family. I think the reason why we should celebrate International Men's Day is we know that men are good at talking about how well they've done uh, and celebrating in their own lives, but actually I think what's more important than that is to give others an opinion, a voice, to be able to st step up and say, you know, we can do better, we can inspire others, others that perhaps might need help. Um, and I've always looked at it as that, an opportunity to help others that haven't got a voice. Um, you know, we're born on this planet, we die on this planet, that much is certain, but what happens in between is very often out of our control. And I know a lot of men struggle with not being able to succeed, not being able to provide, and they don't have a voice. And I think it's really important that we give men an opportunity to voice these needs. Advice about positive mental attitude. Look at what you've achieved in your past. Look at what you can achieve today. Do it one day at a time. Be inspired by other people. Allow yourself to be inspired by other people. Read positive books, look at positive films. Get rid of the negative in your life as much as you can and focus on the now and the day-to-day -day positivity. And that way you'll be able to move forward and progress and become a more positive person. To men in Plymouth who might need support now or in the future, I would say number one is to talk. Find someone to talk to. Share your problems, share your worries, whether it's with a friend, a work colleague, a family member. There are also lots of organizations in Plymouth, like Mind have a men's group, Argyle Trust have a men's group, uh, plenty of others as well out there. Uh, reach out. Um, and try and find a path forward through those around you. There's plenty out there to help. I feel very lucky to be part of a team at St. Luke's Hospice. Our fundraising team work very closely together. We reach out into the community and we offer support to people who have been through very difficult times. Um, and I feel that I've found myself in a position where I can actually help these people and empower them through fundraising. Um, to sort of take them on their journey through bereavement and out the other side and to empower them with those positive tools to move forward. Um, all of my teammates get this and it's a feel good job with some very sensitive moments. Um, but I can take that feel good factor back to my family and I can be a strong husband and a strong father to my two sons and hopefully give them the tools that they need to progress in their lives.